I really don't know how to start off a video, but I mean, clean ass on feet. But what's happening? First time seeing a face. I know, right? So, trying to do a little vlog style today because it's been a minute since I uploaded something. It's been a while. It's been bad. You know, being out here in the Northeast, CT specifically, we've been having very, very bad last month. The weather's been horrible. It's been nothing but snowing and raining and shit. But today, we got a really nice ass day. To keep it a buck, it is supposed to be touching 57 today. So after about maybe three to four months of just being in 20, 30 degree weather, feels like summer out here but spring is coming so it is what it is but what we're gonna do today because i got it a little bit washed up yesterday i'm gonna take the hood off and uh get some nice engine noises turbo intake all the nice little swishes and swooshes everybody loves because i do get a lot of compliments on um how good my car sounds and i do want to take some pictures because it does look dope you feel me um, ain't nothing really has changed. Uh, I deleted, um, the airbag and the seatbelt light. Um, if you have a focus and you want to know how it's easy, you just pull this up. There are two screws. You take, you know, take those out. This literally just slides out. Then it's got pry clips. You, you know, get like a flathead, plastic pry clips. You know, you pop them all out gently. You don't want to break none of them. You pull it out and, um, this is actually uh it was a long process because you can't just like simply like take it like the face and the needle fully off so you gotta like kind of bend it because it is you know it is bendable um so you bend it and just you know carefully place the tape down and it was trial and error so what ended up happening to me was that the tape was like pushing this skinny face up just a little bit and it was causing the needle to not be able to move so i had to go back in redo the tape then had to tape down some corners in the back that obviously you won't see, but it's there. We're working again, and we're all good. And voila. So, obviously, it's gonna have to be those screws right there. Not this. Well, gives me a better opportunity. Oh, so it does have a real benefit. I get to clean all this shit out. But everything looks good. Everything is clean. I probably should clean this up a little bit. I got some uh I got some cleaning shit for the car. I should do that. Um yo, it's been hard. Like uh got into some the sticky situations recently. Um buying car parts got kind of slow because I really want to go for the um the go big or go home, which is the big turbo kit. But I actually do want to ooh, what are you you don't smell like nothing but i don't know i haven't touched that shit but whatever um i do want to get wood and i throw some piper cams in i want to buy another one of this and just get it um like the they call it the mirror finish chrome finish whatever people want to call it or refer to it as it's like two different terms but I want to get this chromed because I mean just to make the engine bay look nice because obviously I will end up doing the monsoon intake right here I won't do nothing with it I'll just leave it black like it is and then just keep it like that but shit let's get it going man here we are with it I ain't gonna lie this shit looks dope I don't care uh cleaned this up a little bit trying to make it at least more you know shinier um using some of this chemical guy stuff silk shine dressing sprayable 100 percent dry to the touch and um just you know microfiber cloth you know just i should sure clean everything else off pretty sure people are gonna be like oh my god you're touching too much shit i don't give a fuck it's not a show car yet no no show car parts i don't give a fuck but uh ran into one problem man so this is the cables to the front windshield wiper spray broke them fuck them shit oh man it's gonna be funny as hell let's get a fucking oh i need to get gas too that's mad funny i forgot all about that shit oh man so i'll go ahead and get you know 
she warms up and shit, I'll, uh, get some, uh, nice little rev ups and shit, but, so I lost the other piece to this, the cover to the fog, um, bezel flew off, I brought this one just in case, if I take any pictures, I'll just mainly focus on the driver's side, and not really try to capture both the, you know, both sides of it. So at least it could look nice pictures wise. Um, but. Oh, this shit is gonna be so fun today. It's gonna be funny as hell. Oh man. <laughs> So, pulled up here to my local beach to go ahead and try to get some pictures. One spot was uh, the main part I wanted to go to is closed off. For some reason, I don't know. Oh, let me keep that break up. Um, so, hopefully, the shots I did get were good. Um, the car sounds dope with the hood off. Like, you could really hear like the flutter. You could really hear, you know, you could hear the blow of out. All right, so he's at Starbucks. It's actually a nice place. It's actually a nice little area where our city is at. Um, just making sure. Go ahead and adjust the camera. So you get a nice little POV ride. Um, I won't really talk much. I'm not gonna play no music because copyright. beach it's nice it looks beautiful but that water that's a no-go bro like that water is so disgusting like it sounds so fucking good like and to be honest like i mean i want to get a carbon fiber hood i'm gonna get one but um Taking off the hood though, like unscrewing it and shit, like it wasn't heavy, it wasn't hard. I mean, my cousin ended up um, pulling up on me and he actually helped me out a little bit, which was, um, it was dope. Cause um, you know, it didn't, it's not like it, it's not really needed. So if you have this car and you're gonna do, like whether you're taking the, whether you're taking off the hood for any reason, whether it's to put a carbon fiber one, a new one, a painted one, you're doing what I'm doing. Um, to keep it a buck, it is it is a one man job. It really is a one man job. You don't need two people. But if you have a second person who's you know willing to help, wants to help, or is around, you know, it could make it a little easier. Maybe, but I don't think it's it's not a two man job taking off the hood on this car. Um, but you know, with breaking the cables, yeah, that. That was a pain in the ass and fuck it, I don't really care. It is what it is. Like, I be forgetting to put fucking windshield washer fluid in this bitch anyway. So it's like. Get y'all more of that sound. But, um, you know, real easy. The hood is light as fuck. Like, that's dope. So I can just imagine. I can just imagine what a carbon fiber hood would feel like with this car because it's like the stock hood was already light as it is but i'm pretty sure you know carbon fiber is carbon fiber so pretty sure that i could fucking really i could probably spin that shit on my fucking finger you know so <laughs> low key but uh I'm trying to think what's the best way to get to his ass i think i'm on the right track
I can just imagine what it's going to be like with the fucking bigger turbo and shit. Damn, with the external waste gain and everything. I got some plans for this bitch. You feel me? I'm done. You had to take screws off for that? Huh? Take the screws out of there? Yep. What? Yep. Right here and shit. But, I ended up breaking my windshield wiper fluid lines. Ooh. So I, I, I have snapped one because I was trying to pry it off. And then in the midst of trying to pry it off, it just snapped. So I said, fuck it, I just ripped off the other one. So now my lines don't work no more, so fuck it. But zip tied them, tucked them up. Many hours. All right, back at the crib. So uh, apparently got some like oil splashes or something coming from I don't know. But I'm gonna clean it all up and uh, pop the hood back on and call it a day. Hopefully these pictures came out good. So something fun to do today. Enjoy the weather. But uh, catch y'all the next one.